Welcome, welcome to my channel. I am your host, Murder Mittens, and this is my intro video for my Let's Play Stardew Valley. Um, I had originally intended to complete this Let's Play without commentary. However, uh, about a week's worth of videos, I realized, um, I needed commentary. Uh, I needed to explain my actions, my thought process, and honestly, um, explain or share my experience with all of y'all. So, I've never completed this game. And by complete, I mean I've never made it to the dawn of my third year, and which is when your farm gets evaluated by somebody. I forgot who. But anyway, point is, the furthest I've ever gotten is the dawn of my second year, and uh, that basically means anything after that is practically a blind playthrough for me. Um, I say practically just because I have seen some spoilers here and there. It's just I've never actually got into that point. Um, and, well, it's going to be a new experience and I wanted to share that with y'all. Um, that being said, enough with the yada yada. Let's, let's build our character. Now, uh, personally, I don't think you guys want to be tormented any further by actually watching me create my character. Uh, so I'm just going to, you know, fast forward, well, more like skip to the part of when it's all completed. Um, that being said, before I do that, I am going to stick to the normal, but I will have the guarantee one year completability for the community center. Likewise, for the mine rewards, I plan on being normal as well. But other than that, I'll see you when I'm done. And here we are. This is my character. I am Mittens. Our farm is going to be Red Rum. Our favorite thing is, of course, the developer concern name. I figured we would go with the cat. And we are doing the standard farm. Let's get to the intro. And for my very special granddaughter, presumably only granddaughter, I want you to have the sealed envelope. Perhaps only grandchild, who knows? Actually, that would make the most sense, <laughs> considering everything. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now, listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Yup. And your bright spirit will fade before growing emptiness. Dang, he really knows how to hit the nail on the head, doesn't he? When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Oh, you just have to wait until that happens. <laughs> Now, let Grandpa rest. XX years later. Or, also read as 20 years later. Jaja, join us, thrive. I love how they have a work light and a rest light. <laughs> Smile, you're with Jaja. And the only person smiling happens to be on uh, loads of medication, it looks like. Life's better with Jaja. It doesn't look like it. And I'm pretty sure the skeleton in the corner I would have to disagree. <laughs> Is that like leftover Halloween decoration? I would hope so. Can you imagine going to work and you had a body that was like decomposing for months on- Ugh. Anyway. <laughs> so, we finally decided to open up Grandpa's letter. Whose name was- I wonder what his name was. His initials seemed to be P and T. So, like, Peter Thomas? Dear Mittens, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to a place I truly belong. I've enclosed a deed to that place, my pride and joy, Red Rum Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all. And now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. Okay, now we have to 
like come up with a family name here. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Hmm. Family name that starts with the letter T. I will leave it to you, viewers. What is our family name? Leave a comment. In the meantime, apparently I did just as my grandpa did. Decided to quit my job, grab what money I had, and took a bus to Stardew Valley. I must admit, if this happened in real life, I probably would do that too. I got free land? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> I think most of us probably would. Like, maybe some of us would hesitate a little bit, but I think most of us would do that. Hello, you must be Mittens. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. May and Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here, if you'll follow me. Wow. This is Red Run Farm. This is a mess. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Go, Avatar me. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. Mm-hmm. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleared up in no time. <laughs> a little dedication. Robin, you and I need to talk about our definition of little. And here we are, your new home. A free house? Yes! <laughs> ah, the new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. <laughs> rustic, yeah. Rustic. That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Yeah. <laughs> She's not wrong. Rude. And she giggles in the side. It was kind of rude too, but still, she's not entirely wrong. Don't listen to her, Mittens. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied, so you'll buy one of her house upgrades. <gasps> Goes Robin. Although she's not denying it. Anyway, you must be tired from your long journey. You should get some rest. It's like the middle of the day. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. I can't, I can't do that now. The townspeople would appreciate that. Kind of wish they would have allowed you to do it now. Because it, really, it's like the middle of the day. I could have said hi to a few people. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. I also love how he says that, but he's like by the mailbox instead of the shipping bin. It's kind of weird. Dun -dun. And that is it. This is only going to be an intro. I don't want to take too much of your guys' time. Just wanted to let you all know I am doing a let's play of Stardew Valley. And it's actually going to have commentary this time. 